here, we're here. Look at that. Oh, a pond. I don't know if you're allowed to walk on the grass, but I'm doing it. <laughs> Ooh. Look at this over here. Oh, it's so romantic. <laughs> Hi. I want to build one of these. This is exactly the type of thing that I have planned to build. I did do a small scale one, but it got torn down and I was devastated. Oh, look at all these trees. Oh, this is just <sighs> the nature. Oh, look at this. That is funky. So it's Olivia's sanctuary here again and we're out, we're out, we're out, we're exploring. I'm in the most beautiful place ever and let's get into it. So um, this is your gate garden and I have, um, I've seen this on the map, <laughs> I can speak. I, I had seen this a while ago and had wanted to come but I couldn't have picked a better day for it to be fair. God, look at the colour of this. Feels incredible. Oh mouth watering again <laughs> it's nature it's anything that's like really visually beautiful and textured and the colors and oh whoa look how cool is this <laughs> can you see me <gasps> it's wicked i like the certain things that i like when i love it so much when i'm in the environment of it in the presence of it i want to like become it like i want to get into it <laughs> it's a hard thing to describe if you felt it you know you know <laughs> if not then sure it'll happen with something when you love some stuff so much you want to just like be in it <laughs> like when you love someone so much you want to like be under this be, like be in their skin <laughs> i've been there look at this it is absolutely glorious my knees crack. If you hear cracking, it is my knees. We've got this beautiful, beautiful tree. I wonder what tree that is. It's huge. Get a good look at it. How peaceful is this? So gnarly. Mm. Ooh, <laughs> that's so cute with the light. Oh my gosh, the sunlight just shining on it. That could not be more, more perfect if it tried. In love. I'm in love. I am in love. There's a tour coming behind me, so I'm gonna <laughs> get moving. Ooh. That must be a type of fern, but it's a very big unusual type of fern i can't even show you it all like it's so it's so beautiful and it's just everywhere <laughs> oh i love it so much um so paolo nutini has got a new song out it came on on the radio when i was driving here and it is so incredibly beautiful i literally cried oh <laughs> you R R A S nineteen seventy SBS. Hmm. I wonder what that means. I like the writing though. Like it's really cool carbon. I love wood. <laughs> Building things with wood. Mm-hmm. Just wish I could do more of it. But I'm gonna start doing it, and I'm also gonna start making things with clay again, cause um I did it for my uni project. <gasps> Guys, guys, how beautiful is this? Oh, the fish spouting out the water. I'm just having the best time in life right now. Loving it. Ooh, another gnarly tree. That is fantastic wow oh, this is so cool oh it's so twisty and turny so curly 
crispy but like really soft as well oh this is awesome oh, the happiness <laughs> the pure 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 joy that is me <laughs> Ooh. What? the little gardener's shed is this where they keep all their tools Oh my gosh, what the hell? <clears throat> allium. They're drying some allium out. Getting the seeds, probably. Doesn't this look gorgeous? This is actually, like, so aesthetically pleasing. <laughs> this is a work of art. This is a work of art. And all this wood. I just love it. <laughs> I very much love it. If um if you like classical music and oh that's what I was saying, Paula and the team's brought out a song, sorry, and it's called Radio. Um and I highly recommend listening to it because oh it's just stunning. This as well, I mean this it's all just it is a work of art, like he did say that at the beginning when um he was like introducing oh my gosh. Right, we're gonna go in here. This is like this reminds me of if you've seen Harry Potter, like the maze in Harry Potter. Hey. <laughs> oh man. I'm not going back down. Look at all the daisies. The daisies are so sweet. <laughs> okay. I'm back in. Right, we're gonna. This is very uh, Mediterranean, it feels like. I feel like this could be found, oh, I don't know, like anywhere between like Italy and Greece and. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, look at these. All right, yeah, so that's what I was saying. If anybody likes class classical music, um, the my favourite composer, Debbie Wiseman, does a series oh, called, um, she does it with Alan Titchmarsh and he like talks about them um, and it's called The Glorious Garden and she does music, she does like um, compositions to all oh, the bees, the bees are loving it. Uh, to certain plants and then he does like writing to them uh, to be honest I don't listen to his like him talking about them but I love this black grassy stuff um yeah but the the music is absolutely stunning it was how I discovered her on classical radio with one of those songs um and I just fell in love. I was like, whoa, this music is touching my soul right now. And then I kept listening to it. And she does a Zodiac series too, which I really recommend. It's just all so like, good for the, the insides. <laughs> Honestly, sometimes I just don't even know what I'm saying. Well, it says, can you hear the church bells? you know where I'll be going next <laughs> this this is similar to from the other video and it I, I don't know if this is this might not be but the other stuff is um, Crocosmia and it is a member of the Crocus family um, I remember having it in Newcastle when I was a kid at the front of the house so I was, oh, whoa this is private but look at that oh should we go in let's go in Field room and nursery, but oh. I just I want to I want to have my own space like this to make a garden like this. Wouldn't that be awesome? And like just build loads of wooden stuff and have things growing on it, and like build wooden seats. <laughs> I know just everything. Oh man, this is actually awesome. I feel like I'm in oh, <laughs> fairyland right now. So I've been learning about this um, unconditional happiness, right? And uh, I didn't quite get it at first and I struggled to like really connect to it because I was like, certain things make me happy, certain things make me sad. But it turns out that 
I um, I just have to tap into this like place within myself where I didn't look at the sad things as sad and the happy things were in addition to my happiness. So then I kind of got myself into permanent happiness, into permanent goodness, right? And um, now I wake up and I'm like, okay, I'm happy. And I expect the day to carry on like that. And honestly, it is the best place I've ever been in in my life. Like, I don't rely on anyone or anything to make me happy. I just am happy and then and then I get to experience everything else as an addition to my happiness. And I truly, truly love that. Oh, just look at everything, oh my God. I'm so happy. Crescent Bridge. Oh, look at all this. I love the, um, the ground covering plants. This particular one, it looks kind of like Cress. I can't remember the name of it, but um, it needs like barely anything. It doesn't even need, um, it doesn't need any soil. It can just pretty much live off like the ground. Okay, I'm on the wildflower meadow. <gasps> oh, this area is so nice. It just reminds me of Teletubbies. <laughs> The bells, the church bells are really adding to the atmosphere right now. The tall golden grasses are really beautiful, aren't they? Oh, and having this lovely green path through the middle, so perfectly cut out, oh, you can hear, you can hear the bugs. <laughs> what a life, huh? What a life. Skipping through the meadow. <laughs> I love the bells. Love the bells. Keep them ringing. I wonder if there is actually people physically ringing the bells. Like, ding dong. That sound. Another one, like, I want to, like, get into the grasses. So goodbye for now. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy me chatting and walking around and showing you nature um, as much as I love being in it. And take care. Get yourselves out there because see the joy in me and get it for you. <laughs> Okay, Mwah. love you all. Goodbye. Hello, hello. Um, I wanted to give you a full body view of this because it's just so beautiful. Oh, imagine if this is like in your house, you just like opened the door and you, you had this, like, it was like outdoor but indoor. Uh, Oh, oh, that'd be so nice. Or like this was a corridor to another room in your house. And like even if it's raining or snowing or anything, you just got to go through it. Oh, that'd be so cool. <laughs> so nice. We love it. We love it. I'm imagining it. It's going to happen. <laughs>